Hi everyone, hello. Um, yeah, I look a bit funny because I've been to the dentist, so yeah, move the camera. Um, I went to the dentist today, and um, yeah, it, it hurts. Um, so anyway, I can't really smile or talk properly. But today I'm doing like a haul video. I can't. Let me just adjust this. It's gonna move. It's gonna slide. It might slide. You might see the ceiling in a minute, but. You know, that's a bit funny. Um, so, yeah, anyway, I'm going to be doing a haul video. Um, I've been watching a woman called Chucky Kaz, and she is amazing. Just just go check her out, because she is brilliant. Um, she does hauls. Um, she, like, does reviews, things like that, and she's just brilliant. Um, and her voice is so calming that you're watching it and you're like that. I was falling to sleep, but anyway, um, I watched a few of her videos, and let me try and find it. I watched a few of her videos, and she sold W7 to me, the brand W7. She totally sold it to me, and it, look, it just looks amazing, so, yeah. <laughs> I went out, and I bought two of the W7 camouflage kits um, in light, um, and the other one that I bought was the W7 in the nude natural nudes eye colour palette and I really do like this because uh, it's got all the colours that I absolutely adore and they're just so nice and you know some are shimmery and um, some are matte so I don't know I've used it quite a bit as you can tell look at the brush yeah I need to wash the brush <laughs> but they're them and the colours are I don't know which end is okay so if I start here, where are we? That's Latte, Angel, Fenice, Marilyn, Copperpot, Sunkist, Alice, Bad Manners, Coffee Cup, Mudslide, Tokyo, and Fashionista. Fashionista. That word. <laughs> so, yeah, I am absolutely loving Angel, Copperpot, and also Coffee Cup at the moment. And I don't know if you can see it very well. I can't really get too close because. Um, there's obstacles in the way so I've been loving this and it is amazing because it just comes off and it it's not one of those you know where you have to build up and build up and build up to finally get the colour out you know I don't think you can see it very well um, but that's Angel you might have to build it up in your hand so that by the way is just a, a swatchy thing I did earlier on with brown but yeah <laughs> that's for something different so oh so no, that's a bit too much oh I don't know if you can see but that's it there and it is so adorable it's just such a nice colour and they're so silky smooth they're not very like you know eyeshadow is like very powdery but all this is just um this is just really really nice and it's just amazing and it's really really home <laughs> uh, it's just absolutely amazing um, I also bought um, yeah that everyone has got one of these <laughs> like they've got the Africa one um, and they've got this one and um, the Hon Honolulu uh, it's Hawaiian isn't it I think it's Hawaiian anyways yeah everyone has got these I feel like I'm a bit behind the time I'm going to try not to smile, but I don't want to be moody looking. Um, everyone has got one of these. Um, you know, I've used it a fair bit. Um, because I've just been using it for, like, you know, contouring. Con contouring. Ugh, it's really annoying. Um, I can only do the video today because I'm busy for, like, every day. Um, starting from tomorrow to next week. So, it's just a bit frustrating. <laughs> so, I thought I'd just quickly get out of the way now. So everyone has got it. Look how dirty it already is. What a tramp. But yes, yeah, so I'm absolutely I'm loving that. And she totally sold the brand to me. Um W7. I've heard of W7 before and I thought oh, it was just one of those, you know, cheap kind of brands, but they're actually quite expensive. Um this one was. Um this cost me I think it was um eight pounds, seven pounds. Um I can't remember, and I've bought 
fell out. I've bought quite a few of these um, because I just thought they're absolutely amazing. And I've also stocked up on um, my argan oil because I love argan oil because my hair is just so. It used to be quite dry looking, but now it's like. I don't know. It's just, it just feels a lot more healthier and a lot more like thicker. And it, you know, if you've dyed your hair, a lot of times, like I dyed my hair so much when I was younger, and like eventually I just like, you know, murdered it. And I was able to do that, and it was like elastic, like it was just so. Bleh. So I've let my hair just grow out its natural colour and stuff. So I've got no dye, no nothing in my hair. It's just everything's just grew through again. <laughs> Thank God. Um. So that is my natural colour, and yeah, I'm actually really really happy with it. I was thinking of you know putting some highlights through, but I've actually my hair not bragging <laughs> but my hair has already got highlights going through it like this none of this is actually hair dye um as i said i haven't dyed my hair in a, in a very long time um i've just let all my color grow out and you know i had to trim the ends because it was just because i did bleach my hair stupid of me but i did bleach my hair and i was just left with like you know <laughs> like your platinum blonde kind of tips and it was just, it looks quite horrible because in some places it's obviously grown through quicker uh, because I used to have layers and stuff, you can't really, really see now. But yeah, <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'm, I'm happy with it and you know, I discovered argan oil um, the hair treatment. I've also bought the conditioner which is free to the other room, I should have bought it free but I never. But, um, pain hold on um but yeah so i left that through there but i did i brought this through because i treated my hair this morning and it is absolutely if you haven't got it already and then i seriously do you know recommend it because it is absolutely amazing and like i think it was within like a few days i saw results like my hair it just feels really really nice and it's quite young feeling if you don't want to be like that young feeling and um, when you're a teenager and you haven't touched your hair and you don't really use too much product on it and it's just like you know that kind of feeling but i try not to use too much product on my hair now because you know i absolutely love you know moisturizers things like that and you know but i just think it's just chemicals going into my body so I've tried to do without putting too much, you know, products, like different products on my face and on my skin and stuff. And without that, I've actually noticed the difference that my skin, it's it's looking a lot more balanced to know. It's just, you know, that's without products. Whereas before I was using it, it was like obviously drying my skin out. So I'd go out and buy that product again. And I was like, hmm, you know. Someone's uh, very good at marketing here, <laughs> but yeah, so I just haven't really been, I've been using makeup, obviously, um, I'm still using this, and need to go and get some more, um, wake me up, I pulled the label off, I have a thing about labels, what happened then, I have a thing about labels, but yes, I pulled that off, and also, yep, I feel like a kid, I've bought loom bands, and I've made I made quite a few <laughs> loom bands and I got these cute little charms that's actually purple but it's showing up blue. <laughs> um, I got a pink one and I got a smiley face one. So that's really really cute. Um, you also got the flat, the colours do not match but I just think that the, the colours just, I don't know, they go nice together. It's like a massive contrast and oh that one let's go with that so cute and i've been so obsessed with making now i've got the um orange ones god this video is so gonna turn <laughs> orange ones with um white bits i know it looks like a little wheel <laughs> and i just got you know multicolored ones and um, we've got pink black red um all these were the colors that were in there but obviously I didn't want to use too many and I've got more little charms. I've got a little heart. Um, another little heart with an arrow going through it. 
and this one is so cute. Oh, this one, it's um, feng, feng shui, feng shui, feng shui. I don't know. Yeah, it's um, that kind of a symbol, um, the Chinese symbol or Japanese. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. I'm really, really bad at this. But is it feng shui? Something like that. But yeah, so. I just wanted to do a quick video and also um, please do go out um, go over and check uh, Chucky Kaz. I hope I said that right <laughs> but she is just brilliant and you know she's the advice and the information and everything that she gives it's just so in depth like in detail and it's just brilliant um, she's done you know tried and tested kind of videos um, product updates and um, things like that and um, I'm looking at her screen now <laughs> um, because my mind's all worry and I'm in pain but yeah um, she is just brilliant and she's definitely one of my um, top subscribers because as I said she's very is it informative when it comes to things like that and also because obviously I'm approaching 30 <laughs> so my skin it's not looking as young as it once was so I need like you know help with that I go to like you know the channel where you got like you know teenagers things like that and it's like well you're not really in my age age range <laughs> um age range so it's like you've all got beautiful looking skin and then I'm here like mm, drab <laughs> I'm a drab, but I don't really care. So, yeah, I've gone off what I was on about. <laughs> Pins and needles. I've gone off what I was on about now, but yeah. Um. Also, what I was going to say to you, I was going to say something. Yes, Um. Oh, I forgot what I was going to say. Um, now, finally, she is. I also went out, I went ahead and I bought some nail varnishes and these colours are just absolutely amazing I'm not prepared these colors are just amazing and that one was open <gasps> that was my heck using it <laughs> it wasn't really um I've got that color on at the moment and it actually doesn't even tell me what color it is yeah it does coral romance that color it looks a lot more red but it's actually really not it's just so pretty I love this and you know, it's really, really nice. I'm one of those people, I'll get carried away with using things. So I, paint, I painted my nail all different colours. Not, not one nail, but all nails, different colours. And I'll show you the colours. This one is Misty Jade. Um, That one. That is so pretty. Um, This one is Just By Me. Oh. So that's the colour. That is really, really nice. It matches my dress <laughs> yeah I dribbled I went to the dentist I don't care don't judge me but yeah so that's that one and also this one which is tangerine Qu tangerine queen um I don't know if you can see that too well but it's that one and it's so pretty and it's you know I definitely I heart Rimmel I really do Rimmel can't do no wrong when it comes to you know, nail varnishes and uh, foundations. Sorry, I'm just in pain now. Um, also, I bought the Kate Moss lipstick. Yeah, I don't really like it. I, I really don't. I just found it was quite. Um, I've got the shimmer one. Um, I'm not wearing it now. I'll give it away. Um, I didn't actually put on my lips and then give it away. I like swatched it kind of on my hand and I was like you know doing that as you do and I was like it's quite bitter and it was like the shimmer one and it was it's not something I'd really wear you know I mean you've got your lip scrubs and you know the exfoliating thingies but I don't want it in a lipstick and I don't want it to be on me all day <laughs> I want to quickly rub it in because I've got the one from Lush um, the chocolate and orange one is it chocolate and orange or mint and orange? One of those lip scrubs, anyways. And it's just amazing hiccups. And it is just absolutely amazing. And so, not the Kate Moss lipstick, it's really not for me. And I'm not too keen on Kate Moss's 
brand. I'm not too keen on Kate Moss. Um, because, I, I don't know, I just feel like the products are a bit too, you know, a bit dodgy. I don't know. I'm, other people might like it, but for me, it's not something that I would personally like to wear. I just wouldn't. Um, because the lipstick, you know, it's not the first lipstick I have tried of Kate Moss. Um, there's, been, there's been quite a few, and I've just found that the texture, um, texture, <laughs> the texture, uh, the consistency of it, it's just all the same, and it's just... I don't know, it's just really not for me. <laughs> it's just really not for me and I don't I don't think I'd want to wear it. Um, I also I normally wear Batiste, Batiste, the dry shampoo. I almost always wear the blush one. But I got that one. I know I said I don't put a lot of product on my hair, but it needs dry shampoo. Can't be doing no harm. And this is like the my mum said that this like the same packaging and the same pattern and the colour and everything was the same as what she used to have back in the 60s slash 70s so it's a pretty retro so I was like oh okay I'll give it a go and it does smell really really nice and you know it, it doesn't tend to leave that grey white kind of mess on your hair and um, so I've used it and it, no you can't really say anything <laughs> so yeah I think that is it um, I just wanted to do the quick video obviously the W7 I do recommend um, to anybody to get W7 because it is amazing and also I, I've had um, a naked palette <laughs> naked um, naked palette I can't remember what it was because I'm not really too big on them everyone's like oh my god but I see myself as not one of those people that tend to I'm going to contradict myself now but I'm one of those people that don't tend to go out and get what everyone else has got. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. You know, every, I know everyone's got this. I tried it and I was like, okay, I do like it. It's good. But the Naked palette, um, I don't, I don't really like. And this is just exactly the same almost, really. Some people are going to be like, how is it? But to me, it's my personal opinion and my view. It is quite the same um, as the palette that I did have. I can't remember what palette it was. It, as I said, a, it's just a makeup palette. Um, but yeah, but I'm absolutely loving the W7 brand. I have, I have saw W7, you know, around, and loads of people, not loads of people, but quite a few people, and that I've saw uh, actually do have this, and they prefer it more to the you know, high street kind of brands like Urban Decay, you know, NARS, things like that. Um, I laughed out loud the other day. NARS um, blush orgasm. Yeah, I've heard quite immature, but I don't know, the woman she just come up to me and then she went, and this is NARS's orgasm, and I was like, what? Excuse me? <laughs> Trying to sell that product to me? Um, but, you know, it was quite nice. It was actually very, very nice. Um, but it's just one of those you had to have been there and you know the way that she just come out about it like oh and this is nice it's orgasm <laughs> okay I'm gonna go over there <laughs> but yeah it's just brilliant so yeah I think that is actually it from me um I'm lucky I don't have to do a lot of editing in this but as I said please 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 go and check out Chucky Kaz um I'll leave the link down below I'm um, in the description area um and yeah, just keep safe and stay beautiful. So that's it. Yeah, and I'm going to go and cry in the corner and recover. So yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.